your Saturday morning. It is All-Star Weekend. Mother Nature, though, bench today. It is definitely a cold one. We've got wind chills, single digits, actual air temperatures in the teens throughout the day. And, of course, our winds gusting to near 50 at times. So, not a stellar kind of day here in Cleveland. At least we're getting some breaks of sun from time to time. But there will still be some lake effect snow. has been windy uh, for much of the area, especially along the lakeshore. Now, when you factor in the winds, we've got single digit wind chills right now. It feels like one at Hopkins, five in Ravenna, Port Clinton near the winter at two below is what it feels like. So these wind chills are going to be with us all day long. In fact, the worst coming throughout the morning and the first part of the afternoon, and then still single digits, but it gets better here as we get into the evening. So here's what's going on on Storm Fox right now. The actual front itself has moved through the area. We still have some moderate to heavy snow showers in and around parts of Medina, Summit, and Portage County. And then as you can see, some late effect snow starting to set up over the lake. We've got one streamer here that extends through Metter over into, let's say, Leroy, maybe just north of Thompson there. This other band is going to drift into Vermilion, Avon Lake, and over towards downtown Cleveland, I think, in the next at least hour. And then looking ahead here, we still have some moderate to heavy snow right around 76. We could uh, see some whiteout conditions. Of course, that snow is going to be blowing around so if you are traveling in around the akron area i would hold off for about a couple uh, half hour to an hour and then that snow should be out of here as it continues to drift to the south and east here's that cold front itself but if you notice Lake Superior and Lake Michigan. We're seeing some lake effect streamers. I always like to look upwind what's behind the front. So I do expect lake effect snow streamers to set up across our area where those bands persist, an additional one to three fluffy inches possible on top of our coating to an inch that we got today. It is 19 degrees. So here's a look at your hour by hour. We're going to hang out right around 19 as we go through the afternoon. Again, clouds winning out. There will be scattered lake effect snow showers to the first half of the day. Tonight, we clear out, but winds shift out of the south. So we'll start off the morning in the teens. Yes, it's going to be cold, but with plenty of sunshine in the afternoon, I expect our temperatures to get back into the mid 40s. It's 20 degrees today, though. Windy, cold wind chills, a single digit sub zero at times this morning. 14 tonight, just a few flurries around, then gradual clearing. And then tomorrow, our temperature 45 with plenty of sunshine as our temperatures rebound. So looking good, even better on President's Day. A mix of sun and clouds, low 50. possibly nearing 60 on Tuesday, but unfortunately that comes with a washout. We've got a lot of rain headed our way on Tuesday, so you know more flood alerts. And then as we look ahead, back down again, we've got a wintry mix of snow Thursday into Friday. Fox 8 is your official